Hi everyone, today I want to show you how to use AutoCAD to scale. Um, it's not a difficult function, but I know some people get confused when using it. So I'm just going to give you an easy tutorial on how to use it effectively. So I'm going to start with uh, drawing just a basic object. I'm going to choose a square today. And I'm going to draw it two dimensions, let's say 10 by 10. So there I have a block that's 10 by 10. So if I use the dimensions, I can see that as well. Let's just check if everything, you, as you can see, it's 10 millimeters as I typed in. So now if I want to scale this, let's say I want to make it twice as big. Let's say I want to make it 20 by 20. So I can select the object. I can go into the modify tab and click on scale or alternatively you can type in S, C and enter. So then I want to click a starting point of from where I want to scale. So um, the point is going to be fixed. The rest of the object is going to scale to whatever you want to scale it to. So I'm going to click that point, the end point there, as my starting point. So what you want to do next is you can either type in you want to make it twice as big so you can type in two and it's going to make it twice as big or alternatively i just use the undo function you type in u enter to go to the undo function or alternatively to scale this object you can select the object you can type in sc or select the modify button then you can select the starting point and you can say reference as you can see there in the command line it asks you if you want to scale to a reference so i'm going to type in r enter to go into reference and i'm going to select the length of this side and i'm going to type in 20 because that's how long i want to scale it so in that case it's going to scale it to 20 millimeters so it's not that difficult to use the scale function um, if you always select a base point that will work for you but thank you guys for watching i hope this clears this up for you thank you bye bye